Good morning, Bear River. It is almost 7.30 in the morning. I am David, and this is the Morning Report. We have a lot of stuff to talk about, but first, let's go over to Starla Dayak with some news on Syria. The president of Syria has been caught using chemical weapons on his own people. President Obama has issued a meeting deciding whether or not to take action. Almost 100,000 100, people have died during the bomb attack, and thousands were injured. Women and children present during the incident tell us how scary the threats were and the feeling they felt they felt when they thought they were going to be killed. Now, back to David. Thank you, Starla. That was very informative. But the government can't do anything about Syria if it doesn't exist. That's right, folks. The government is now in day number five of being shut down. That means just four more days until our nation's economy falls into default, which means we would have to start borrowing money from everywhere. Now let's go over to Chance for the weather report. Hello, and welcome to your on-the-go weather report. I am Chance Ice Cold Larson, and have I got some news for you. We have temperatures in the mid-60s to the low 70s. We have dark and cloudy skies and high chances of off and on rain. I don't know about you, but boy, am I excited. Can you feel that? Winter is coming. Back to you, John. I'm John with your sports. Last Friday, Bear River JV football team started the season off right. They killed the Diamondbacks 33-6. The Varsity also defeated the Diamondbacks 26-7. Good job. Now this Friday, Bear River is going up against Woodland, and boy, are we up for a challenge. Good luck, Bruins. And now, back to you, David. Thank you, John. That will be the end of our report. But first, here's a word from our sponsor, Guile Incorporated. I really need some hair gel. May I suggest... Edible hair gel? Are you lonely? We'll use edible hair gel. They have many different flavors and odors. Best part is, you can eat it. Now only $6.99 at participating Walgreens.